good, I don't know if it's afternoon, no, good evening to you all. But, okay, so I just got finished with my two mile run, which is very, I already discussed on my Snapchat that I, I post a lot of things about my running. Like I say, oh look, I just ran two miles, or look at this selfie of me so perfect in the sun. Yes, I'm very sorry I do that, but, okay. Way back when, when I was younger, I hated running. Like, I would just, I would have anxiety about it, my stomach would hurt, and I would just say, nope, I'm not going to run. Or I would run, and I run with, I would run really slow. So, me and Ronnie didn't have a great relationship. But now, I don't know what it was, but a few months ago, I was just, I just told myself, Emma, just get up and run. And I got up and run, and it wasn't so bad. And I only did half a mile, because I'm not that good. But then I kept going. And then I ran one mile, and I was really surprised. And then, I guess like two weeks later, I was like, okay, let's try two. I uh, tried two. Let's, yeah, let's try two miles. I felt like I was going to die. Like, my stomach hurt. I felt like I was going to throw up. My legs hurt. Everything. My mind wanted to shut off. My body wanted to shut off. It was horrible. But, at least I did it. So, ever since then, now I just either run one mile or two mile. But one day, I'm going to get the guts up to do three miles, which is, which is scary because I remember back then when I tried to do two miles and it really, really felt really gross. I'm going to feel even worse, but it's all about pushing yourself. Like, I know me, as you can tell, I am not the skinniest person, but I'm not the fattest, so I am trying, which that's all that matters. You get up, you go out there, you get up off the couch. At least you're a lot better off than the person sitting on the couch. So, push yourself. That's all I can say. And hashtag, fat girls can run too. I'm going to make that a good hashtag now. Fat girls like me, get out there and run. I'm not t calling anybody fat that I know of. Or I'm not calling you guys fat, but if you're, you're my size, get out there and run and be fit. Just because you're a little, have a little more love doesn't mean that you're not in shape. Yeah. But, <laughs> yeah, sorry, I'm a weirdo. But, oh, look at that. Look at that coffee can right there. I don't even know what's right there, but get out there and just, just start running one day. It helps the stress, makes you feel good in the end, and you sweat, you shed a little bit of pounds, but. <laughs> now that I've been going to school, I've been wearing makeup. Because I usually didn't wear makeup a lot. I only wore makeup on special occasions, but now I'm like, oh, I have to look presentable. So I wear makeup, and now when I take pictures, I look good. And I put mascara on and eyeshadow, but whatever. This is my natural glow of sweat. Ah! <coughs> oh, excuse me. Ah, I hit my face with the Gatorade bottle. But Okay, so my mom bought this Gatorade. And it's called, I got a freaking thing, why won't you, ah, you can't read it, but it says citrus cooler, and she was like, oh, it's a new flavor, and I'll, oh, sure, sure, but it looks kind of weird and gross, and it looks like a cucumber -y taste, but when I drink it, it tastes fantastic, but... <sighs> and again, I'm really sorry for, um, putting a lot of photos of myself on Snapchat of me running, but it's just... It's just a really big accomplishment for me, so. And on time. I also put a lot of pictures of me on Instagram, and I that might be irritating to you, but you know what? Whatever. It's what I want. So. Oh, yeah. Also, go follow me on Instagram and Snapchat. I, I'm, I'm exciting. If you watch me now, why don't you watch me on Snapchat and want, look at my photos on Instagram? Plus, I'm like an amateur photographer. Not really a real one, but I take all my pictures on my iPhone. And I think they look pretty good. I edit with this thing called VSCO Cam, Vice Cam, that's how I say it. And it it makes the pictures look really good. So if you want a good editing one, Vice Cam. I'll put that in the comments below, I think. But <sighs> running makes me feel good. So yeah, today was just my little video about running. But I know I haven't talked in a while. Because, I don't know, I just didn't have that much to say, and plus I was doing stuff, I did homework. Ugh! 
homework. Don't get me started. Okay, so the one thing that I've heard over there. Okay, sorry. Okay, so the one thing that I've learned about about college is that notes are your friend. Rewrite your notes and make them all neat, highlight and stuff like that over and over again and it will go into your brain. You will think more. Tip number two. Listen to classical music or instrumental music when you study because music with words just messes with your brain. So please, if you want better music to concentrate to, listen to classical. But those are only my tips since it is evening. Good evening to y'all. Good night. Buenas noches. And if it's if it's morning time over there, eggsy bakey, wake up. Good morning. <laughs> and if it's lunchtime, spot tea to you. Hip hip cheerio. And pretty much it. So I'm gonna post another video about me going to my grandma's, so keep watching. Hope you like this video. Remember, notes, classical music, and running. Those are your friends.